Hey guys, so we're gonna start this video, but I have some bad news here. Um, we're gonna start with Rafa Marquez, and apparently, guys, the uh, actually the government of Mexico has actually closed all his accounts on Facebook, Twitter, guys. At the moment of recording this, he has no longer a Twitter, he has no longer a Facebook, and I think the same has happened to the singer Julian. Um, Alvarez guys so this is what's happening with Rafa Marquez so that's the first news so let's go ahead guys into the next news and is that uh, apparently uh, Mohamed said that they were the best team uh, they just didn't have enough chances and apparently Jemez uh, uh, got really mad and he said stop talking uh, stupid uh, stupid things and it just a little uh, f thing that happened in the press conference guys in another news, guys, according to ESPN, Fox Sports, uh, Carlos Cisneros should be back to play in El Clásico of Mexico, Chivas versus America. So that's a very good news for Chivas. So let's go into some other news, guys. It's Club León has fired uh, their manager and uh, the manager is going to be taking the spot or just for a, a short term it, until they find a manager will be uh, Ruben uh, Raton Ayala so this is the, the the nickname of the new manager guys so on this time guys I'm not going to show you video just because I, I actually went out today um, a family thing so uh, I'm just going to bring you guys the results so guys um, on the Friday game was Tijuana versus Pachuca it was a 2-1 then we had the Cruz Azul Monterrey 1-1 amazing performance from Corona and then we had Tigres versus Lobos Wap 3-2 León versus Santos 1-2 uh, Morelia versus America a 2-0 uh, Morelia 1 and then Necaxa versus Atlas 2-1 Chivas versus Querétaro 0-0 uh, and then on Sunday, guys, we had Toluca Puebla 2-1. And we also had Veracruz versus Pumas 1-0, uh, guys. And this means the Atlas is in the last part of relegation. So let's go ahead now, guys, into the next week. And, guys, there won't be games until a week from now. So next week, next Friday, won't be any games. The games will return until Friday the 8th. So we have Puebla Cruz Azul. Atlas versus Tigres, Lobos Buap versus Morelia, Querétaro, León, Monterrey, Necaxa, Pachuca, Chivas, América, Veracruz, Pumas, Tijuana, and Santos versus Toluca. And then, guys, here is the table. On the table, we have first spot, Monterrey, second spot, América, third spot, Tigres, Toluca on fourth, fifth, Necaxa, sixth, Cruz Azul on seventh, Tijuana, and on eighth, Veracruz. So I think they're doing pretty good. This is the first eight. They are qualified currently to the playoffs of Liga MX. So it looks like it's going pretty good, guys. And we're almost at the half of the tournament. So some other teams needs, need to start winning. So, guys, let's go now into some other news. And I'm going to be talking about the uh, Liga MX uh, for women's, guys. I feel like nobody is talking about it. But Morelia has debuted the youngest woman ever to play on la liga mx for women's guys she's only 12 years old uh the girl you guys see on the screen and she's been playing pretty good for morelia so a very very good thing that morelia is going is doing actually the beauty young uh young girls to play in their team hopefully they do good on this second uh, tournament um, and Liga MX for women is played different. It's on groups, guys. It's not like um, it's not like there's one table. There's actually on groups. Um, Liga MX used to be played like that. Also, guys. So group one, we have Pachuca with 12 points, America with 12, Pumas with eight, Tijuana with seven, Toluca with seven, Morelia with six, Cruz Azul with three, and Veracruz with zero points. So this is actually. Uh, the women's uh, first group so it's uh, two groups of eight i do believe they only have uh the f first four of which i think it's the first first four of which group who qualify or the only two of which group qualify i don't remember that well but second group tigres with 13 points then we have uh, monterrey on second spot chivas on third atlas on fourth Querétaro on fifth 
Santos Laguna on actually six, seven with Leon, and then eight with Necaxa, guys. So these are the groups, guys. So I hope you guys have enjoyed the red car, guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Adios. Thank <laughs> you.